Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Before I talk about today's topic, I'm so sorry for the delay in uploading tutorials because I was finishing my PhD and moving to another country. And this is the first video as a postdoc and I'm recording it in California. So today we're gonna um, initiate our tutorials again with a very simple uh, thing to learn together is how to mutate a a protein in UC Chimera and the reason for that I know that we had another video on how to make it with VMD but you know VMD is asking you to have the PSF file when you mutate a protein and sometimes you don't have it and you don't just mutate a protein very quickly so I discovered that uh, uh, UCSF Chimera is doing this very very easily so we're gonna do it in a minute now so I have like a test uh, file mode with PDB as usual so I'm gonna open it with Chimera so you just hit Chimera if it's installed in your uh, station workstation or computer and the name of your PDB and you have it here so what we're gonna do is we're gonna select uh, an amino acid to mutate and to do that we will show the sequence from favorites sequence and here is the sequence of your protein. And since, since I have only one chain, it shows the sequence of a chain A immediately. But if you have multiple chains, you're going to have like chain A, chain B, or chain C, or whatever. And then you select. So we can mutate uh, this residue. If you go by the mouse over it, you will find that it's appearing down here. So if I go like that, it's alanine 72. So click and drag it. So now I select it. So let's see where is it. Okay, here we go. So I want to show this, uh, show the atoms of this residue. It's not like a new cartoon. So I go to actions, atom and bones, and I say show. So here we have it. You can have different representations, but we don't need that. We just need a uh, dirty quick mutation. So uh, I'm going to tools. Chimera doesn't have a mutation tool called mutation, it's called Rotomers. So in tools, uh, and there is Rotomers, in, first you go to structure editing and you go to Rotomers, okay? And then it's alanine, we can make it GLU, okay? Because we're going to have a longer sided chain and show some different possibilities of this chain. So this is the Rotomer library, I use the default one and I will say apply. Okay, so what it tells you here, it tells you that the different possibilities of your sided chain. So you have to choose the one that has uh, less clashes, which will be uh, in the top, I guess. And you have to, if you're going to suspect that you're going to have clashes with, the, with your mutation, you have to show all the the stuff within five angstrom from from your amino acid and compare if you have clashes or not so i'll choose this which looks fine you see uh we have nothing but we can you can deep investigate but this is just you know to show you how to make it and i'll say okay cool so now we have the side chain of glu not ala so I'll go to file and save a PDB and we're gonna call mute okay okay let's uh, get sure that we mutated you know never trust the computer so I will show the original file which was modded PDB and I'll go down it was 72 yeah it's Allah okay and we're gonna open a new tape and i will vi not test test it was i don't remember yeah vi mute dot pdb not ttt dot pdb okay i'll go to 72 yeah so here we go glu yeah and here was ala so you don't have to have the psf uh, and this is pretty easier and I like it because you can compare the clashes and different possibilities of the side of chain so sorry we love VMD but I started to like Chimera 
that's the the first video as a postdoc so i just started with a very simple thing to raise my energy to make more videos but soon i will gonna upload uh, more tutorials i have a lot of ideas and a lot of energy now to uh to do more tutorials okay good luck learning see you